What's going on? Move the mouse here back in City Skylines with our Let's Play Season 9, Episode Number 9, The Town of Swamp Scott. It's better than it sounds. And uh, we forgot to do a couple things in the last episode. I love this shot right here, though. I gotta, I think, put that uh, highway in the background as an underpass. It's an elevated highway over there. So we get the exits coming underneath instead of going over. And it wouldn't be quite so bad in the skyline there. But one thing I wanted to start with today was just a little bit of decoration here over on the edge of the map. So I want to drop in a fresh water outlet, which does it, I think it goes that way, right? Yeah, it's going to dump out that way. Let's see if this was close enough for power. I don't, I don't know that it was. This is an odd building though. This, uh, I want to say came with the Green Cities DLC and uh, it'll take excess water and, and basically dump it out. Um, it's complaining about power right now, which it definitely shouldn't be. We've got, man, I could probably adjust my budget. So that should take excess water. Oh, I'm on one time speed. Let's, <laughs> let's, let's start by speeding that up a bit. So there we go. We'll uh, we'll fill this in. We'll uh, we'll try and keep an eye on that. Don't want to flood things, but uh, maybe that was a mistake. But I guess time will tell. Uh, one thing that I definitely forgot to do in the last episode: dropped in a new metro station. Where uh, where are those? So we have this first one here, the uh, the inner city bus hub, where uh, we get buses, coach buses from outside the city get people coming in and out and connect them straight into our metro which brings them across the river over here to our university stop and kind of our original little uh, town center and then dropped in another stop over here but totally forgot to drop a, uh, a line in with it so for right now let's just delete this one Where is my cursor? There we go. And then we'll just come back. Get some people moving up and down this. We had to start looking at alternate routes. Maybe some uh, some bus service, some pedestrian paths. I think I've, I've made space for them. I'm pretty sure. Maybe today's kind of a, a transit episode. Get some people moving around uh, a little better. We know we've got this problem junction. This was never designed well. Let's... Uh, Let's watch it do its thing, though, here for a minute. It's heavy, but I'm not planning on adding a lot of traffic over here. And if anything, hopefully we're reducing some of it by getting some people moving along the metro here. So now we've got a... I was going to say an above-ground station, a standard station, and one of the hub buildings uh, over here. That metro doesn't look like much because it's under the building, but... So now that we've got that all connected, let's let's take a quick look. I know economy, we can adjust our budget for power. Let's come down to 80%. Let's see what that looks like. That should get us through the episode. Water, we're pretty good. And Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what? Why? Come on. This is what I get. This is what I get for having fire-free episodes. Uh, you're just going to pull right in that station, huh? You see that? The metro went right through. Like, it didn't even care. Oh, man. It's a little crispy, but it's still good. It's still good. All right. Well, that's... Uh, got that out of the way. Let's make sure we're not flooding anything over here. It looks good. I don't know. Th this might drain off faster here than we can fill it. So if that is the case, we might have to add a couple water outlets or do a little bit of landscaping here. But I thought that would be kind of nice. Have uh, if we fill that in just right, we might be able to have a little marina there. Use some of the park objects. I think there's a, a fishing pier or something. Uh, that just abandoned. Not enough educated workers, and not enough water over here. Hold on. We might want to buy another tile and. And start expanding this uh, 
this downtown area because we can start doing office but in order to do that we need educated workers so uh electric is good water's good fire safety <laughs> not so hot i was gonna say not so hot but that's terrible phrasing uh this one is just yeah that one's just going up should be good there wow they got there quick did they like that they keep themselves busy that's that's what it is that was that was kung fu and decoy right there hold on a second uh where do i do, where do I, wait where am i what day is it um fire truck. i wonder if fire ah whatever I, I was gonna see if we uh could could see the names of the the seriously seriously all right, so today's the fire episode. For those of you that uh, that had been missing out on the uh, the multiple fire-free episodes this season, don't worry, fear not. Uh, we won't let you down. Now, why are these buildings not well covered? Is it because they don't have physical coverage from here? I mean, they're they're so close to the depot. I'm hoping that that's not a big deal. And we've got decent decent coverage over here. Probably want to drop one in over this way once we establish where this road's going. So since we've got the cache and the fires, let's, let's get out in front of that over here and we'll throw a uh, 12 that We'll just do a small fire station for now. We're, we're not, I, I'm not dead set on where everything's going over here. This is definitely going to be a, a really main avenue. So when we upgrade to the larger stations... I think that's why we space things out like we did here. We'll move the schools. Speaking of, squirrel. Crime. We're doing all right. Healthcare, death care. I'm pretty sure I've been slacking on my death care. So we've got a cemetery here. Two covering that side of town. A little bit light over here. Maybe we do, can we do crematoriums? Is that, uh, is that a thing yet? It is not. When do we unlock that? 16,000. Not that far off. Maybe we, uh, maybe we buy this tile up here. We know we're going to make this a, a, a bigger downtown area. And that gets us, a, I think, shipping. I think that got us shipping. So let's expand over here just a little bit. We've got some demand. Before we dive back into a, kind of a health check, let's see. We could do an office park back here towards the highway. That might be all right. Let's do something like this. We'll leave a little bit of room. We'll leave a, a space for a pedestrian path plus two. So we'll put the pedestrian path right in the middle. And let's come out 15. What's that look like over here? Is that that's all zonable? So let's freeform. I don't know, about a 45 degree. Ah no, let's curve it. Is that about halfway? I hope. That looks pretty good. So a little office park there. Where is that running power to? We're gonna move that. We're gonna move this power line. Uh, electric extension cords. Always a fix-it-later project. I I mean to go in and clean up the power line. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't. Electric roads is a uh, fantastic mod on PC. Uh, I want to say it's Clite, Clite 45. Uh, it's in uh, my my collections that I post on my PC videos. Um, that is that has just made me so spoiled. I don't, I don't even think about power lines anymore because the roads just spread the power. Um, I mean, it's nice. It's a nice aesthetic, but not the most fun thing to manage when it cuts through your zoning. 
when you forget to connect it. <laughs> so we'll have a, the industry demand should be met over here before too much builds in. Let's do a little something with the center there. Uh, landscaping paths, park path with decorative trees. So let's see if we can, can we snap this just across? We'll come down the middle. Do the same thing up here. Where do we go at kind of odd angles like that and cut into that zoning? What if we do that and then let's break out our zone brush? And we'll dezone that. That's too tiny. definitely want this one to take up if it's going to do anything the two no let's get rid of that that's too small fill it in with some trees some decoration okay three times speed back to it so we've done a little uh a little nook there for an office park um maybe what we can do over here we'll have a, a bit of a dead zone so i'm thinking well, well we'll stash some city services or something over here and give it tunnel access or uh, its own unique highway entrance. Uh, what do we need now? Commercial. This should fill in the industrial demand. Or not fill it in, but allow us to meet it. And then we'll need another little commercial pocket over here. So how are we balanced? We've got commercial on the main strip and very little of it. We don't have another intersection on on this street yet. We are going back to the health check. Don't worry. We're not we're not neglecting that. We gotta check on that water soon. But I feel like the longer I wait, the more suspenseful it is. So what if we come down here? Do we meet up with this road for the office park? I think we do. We'll do that, and then what can we get in here for streets? Can we get two with no overlap? No. So we'll do one kind of right in the middle. Almost in the middle. Leave a little bit of space there. And then why don't we bring this down here and do the same thing this way, except we'll... Oh, I didn't mean to do that last leg there. I like them to line up nice when they can. We'll go down the middle here. Right? Oh, oh, one off. One off for uh, another pedestrian path, but that's all right. Let's do a little commercial pocket here. And this is going to be high density. We're not going to do that one. We'll do here and all along the highway. Ooh, we got to get those train tracks back in. We'll go underground with that. Or maybe bring it between the highway if we can. I don't, I don't want to eat up that zoning. We still haven't connected the... Uh, come on. <laughs> come. Why? Seriously. Make it up for it. I, did, I feel like we didn't see one for, for at least a good three episodes. And now we've got, what, four or five? I'll, I might have to throw the fire counter up on, on this episode. If I didn't already. I'll go back and check. Might get uh, It might get bad. Ah. Uh. Do we do we finish zoning? I'm gonna leave this open for some kind of park or larger, uh, unique building down the road. Let's do this. We'll do um, since we've still got a good amount of demand for it. Let's do office right there, and then maybe. Where are we going to do our next residential area? I think it would be good to kind of start folding in a new grid. So when you when you look at this big area, right? Hang on, two seconds. Uh, let's do water. Let's let's make sure the people over here are covered with the stuff that they need before I start looking to futures. Um,
Good enough. All right, anything burning? Nothing's burning. Anything flooding? No, that seems to be pretty good. I Hopefully we'll be able to maintain uh, a decent level there. All right, we'll come back to that. So back to over here. We've got a tremendous amount of residential demand. A tremendous amount of residential demand. I, I just feel like those words did not come out right. Um, what are we, four lane here? So let's say, right, we've got the four lane with trees. Maybe there was a, you know, another road that met up here. This is the old town square. I always, I always think about it in that kind of context um, of how a town got built up. And you might have a road and a grid that was built off of an old shipping route, an old harbor. Right, so something like this. Now we w we won't necessarily keep this, right? This is not uh, this is not going to stay maybe the whole length. Maybe we'll we'll break it up in the in the in the middle a bit. Um, I know you see it. I see it. <sighs> um, yeah. So the highway bends all over it when you look at things at a grand scale. But I mean, ultimately, what's it doing? It's it's going straight, and and local roads. We'll do that, right? They go straight for a while. Um, and in some cases, they go straight for a, a really long time. And, you know, this this may have supported all the traffic coming from the river, feeding off into this area, which eventually became, uh, you know, upgraded to a highway. Everything's got a history. And here's where we start folding in kind of a new grid into our pattern over here. So we'll still apply the same principles. I'm still going to come down here and keep my intersections... A bit separate and in this case maybe a little bit of space maybe even a little bit wild linking up with that road right and then do we connect with this I think we could I think we get a little crazy over here because this is ultimately gonna hook up with this road. And that's kind of where our grids are going to get merged, right? We're going to kind of tuck things in together. So we could connect this out this way, maybe. And maybe we won't overlap that zoning. Or try not to. There we go. Um, and maybe we connect down like... Like that... There's two different snaps there, and that's the one I want. Because I don't want my, my zoning to get all messed up here. So we get a little, a little tight in here. But that gives us, you know, some decent spread. We can fill in things a little here. It, you know, it looks a little crazy. But, you know, it, it's about this road meeting up with that road. Not necessarily making the grid work in between. Um... At least that, that's how I see it in, in my mind, right? Not to be perfect. But, uh, you know, you can you can still do grids and all the same principles. We're definitely going to have to break out some tree brush over here. Let's check the water real quick. <laughs> well, all right, yeah, well, we're definitely filling it up. We'll, come, we'll be back. You keep doing your thing over there. Uh, Zoning-wise. So I built all that up. We need residential. And then we need to go back and look at what's happening. So where's this going to go? That So I think we're going to have to buy this tile just to feather things off towards the edge of the map correctly. Or at least the way that I want to. Not that I ever do. You know, finish a build. <laughs> Very rarely. Um, something comes out. Something happens. You're going to move on to the next one. But we'll go back. We'll go back to all of them. But, you know, I think we have to kind of buy this. I don't think we can kind of end things right here. I think we have to at least use that tree line that's there because we can't delete those trees if we can't, you know, touch that tile. Um, let's do all of this in behind here as high-density residential. And then maybe this be a little bit of mixed zoning for some offices they probably won't bother the residents too much 
and we'll get one block on the opposite side of... Let's do all this in commercial. Well, not yet. Not yet. We're going to we're gonna mix it in. We don't have the demand for it right now. But we don't want people to, to have to go too far. Then again, we could be creating some traffic nightmares. Uh, let's get the water all hooked up over here. Where was our grid? <laughs> our grid is everywhere at this point. Where where should I be going? Right here? Yeah, let's delete that. And, and do this the way that we're supposed to. Okay, so that's all covered. Can we come down this way? What? Uh, okay. I guess I didn't run pipe in parallel there. We'll just do that for now. Man. We might start a new... Uh, that's the other thing. Because of the, the change in grid, we, we might want to consider breaking the pipes here and starting to grid that way. Um, that way we don't have to waste coverage on areas that we don't need. Garbage coverage. Hmm. I don't think we did that over here, did we? All right, hold on. Back, you know what? Back, back to it. Electricity. Back to the top of the list. Budget. Let's knock it up to 100. Not going to mess around with it again this episode. All right, so we're good on electric. Water, let's let's keep powering through so we don't have to add water. Fire safety. You got a bit of abandonment happening in the background. Fire safety not so great. I don't I don't care what this chart says, not so great. Um Let's give another station down here. Can't have enough fire stations in this town. All right, but let's not waste our time. Let's go back into info views. I think we're, we're good enough. We're good enough. We'll, we'll see where the problems are. They'll be in flames. Um, crime. We're doing pretty good. Detain criminal 71 out of a capacity. So we're going to start dropping in some of the bigger, uh, bigger stations and things like that. Maybe, in fact... Do we do it there or do we do it here? Let's do that now. Hold on. <laughs> We're going to upgrade our coverage here for hospital, for fire, for police. And I don't even care. We got enough money. I'm just going to move. I'm not even going to move them. We're going to, we're going to redo our education. That might've totally screwed things up. I probably should have moved the schools. Uh, but let's, let's just do this. So we're going to drop in a big hospital right right there. Let's drop in the big fire station. Now, do we do... It, it looks better this way, right? Facing the street. But we know what problems that causes. And we've seen we've seen our luck. So I'm doing, I'm doing this. I'm putting them on the side street. That way they can turn any which way they want uh, immediately. I thought about the aesthetics there for a second, and then I remembered my luck this episode. Uh, police? Why not? Same thing, right? Face the side street. Uh, makes a little less sense again aesthetically. Is that a university? That is. So can we get those schools back in here? Do we, do we even have to move them in the first place? See all these kids that just left the high school? No, we did not. Uh... Okay. Well, we've... We did something. Uh, Demand-wise, office is climbing up. But we'll worry about that in a bit. So, I'll let it play at three times speed in the background. Healthcare, that area is very well covered. I like that. Maybe we'll upgrade this at some point. It doesn't look like healthcare we were too worried about over here. We could drop in a couple clinics. Let's do that. Because that, that makes more sense over here. I don't know. This isn't zoned, so. Between those two, that should cover that pretty well. And then we'll do the same thing over here. Where can we kind of... I don't know. We'll, we'll just throw one in over there. 16,000. All right. Let's not worry about that just yet. Let's make sure we didn't forget anything like garbage coverage over here that, uh, that I think I mentioned like 10 minutes ago. While we're on that healthcare tab, though, 
may as well. Where can we fit this? Can we get this in here? Can we get this right in the middle of this block? That's not, you know, that's not the worst use of it. It would probably make more sense over here, though, right? In, uh... That actually works pretty good. What do we zone across the street? I say we do nothing. And we can fill this in with some trees and have a, you know, a, a quiet a quiet area to respect those we've lost to fires and, uh, and garbage piles, apparently. So <laughs> we're on that tab, too. Uh, where do we get another recycle plant in? We've got one, two... So I, you know, I, I wouldn't mind, you know, tucking it in over by the highway somewhere. Um, why don't we? Why don't we just bring it down this way for now? So I'm going to do this. I'm going to connect this. I'm going to connect uh, this road to over here. I don't think we'll keep that. But that just gives the recycle trucks a little bit better of a route if that's where they're going. And we'll put it, you know, where it's comfortably out of the zone. So we don't have to worry about pollution. And water and power. And then we'll get back to it. Okay. Quick glance. Quick. Just anybody? Did anybody see anything on fire? I don't see anything burning. I see the educated workers problem. We're working. We're, we're getting there. We're getting there. This is getting there. Let's not forget that. Otherwise, that'll be a heck of an intro uh, next episode. Uh, let's see. How much do we actually get through here? We've got, we've got death care coverage. Whew, whew, sorry. Sorry, kiddos. Um, okay. Let's let's change things up a bit, right? We'll get a little greener over here. So we've got one school right there. Let's get another school. If I carry that road through, that should be okay. And then we'll do a creative arts right down here on the end. Are we keeping this road? Let's keep this road. Just in case we don't. Just in case we don't keep it, let's... We'll come all the way down here. And then do we have university coverage over here? We do. So what is our situation here? We're good. We just didn't have any nearby. So that's the elementary. Good. Spread out everywhere. We can probably use more over here. I feel like if, if we were meeting that capacity with that many uh, students... I'll have to keep an eye on that. Let's let's oversaturate it just to be safe. We get one more over here. Standard elementary school. High school wise, high schools cover a lot more. And we've got two there. To the three elementaries. Alright. That that's that's plenty. That's overdoing it. Um back in here. 13% unemployment. What's going on there? Not enough uh, educated workers. People don't want to work in the plants, apparently. Relatively happy. And land value is slowly but surely creeping up. Not so much by the uh, industrial area, but our residential neighborhoods are doing pretty good. Ooh, that's a nice, nice little pocket over here. Um... Let's help that along. Let's look at uniques real quick. We've got 391,000 in there. Let's drop a couple parks in. All right, there's the what? The friendly Fountain of Life and Death is the friendly neighborhood park. So let's let's find a spot for this kind of over where we started. It'd be kind of nice, right? Like we have this little park that we made here. You know, do we move do we move this clinic? <laughs> uh, where can we get... I, I don't want to destroy a bunch of stuff, but... I'd like to drop a park in. It's easier on the grid. 
Does that fit perfectly in that block? No, it does not. <laughs> but it looks it looks like it does because of that connection of the uh, sidewalk. So let's come in here and make sure that doesn't happen. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I did not mean to dezone the entire block. Hopefully that didn't uh, disturb anybody. But I didn't want this, right? I don't, I don't want somebody living in the park. How's our water hole doing? It's getting there, right? How close do we get to these people's uh, homes? <laughs> Better yet, please tell me I can still turn this thing off. Where is it? I can't even see it. Okay. So I can interact with it, and I can turn it off. All right, we'll have to come back to that really soon. we we got to wrap up here, so... A quick look through, like, what what do we need to do? We need to, you know, drop in some uniques. I haven't decorated. I haven't, you know, boosted up certain areas. Um, it makes such a big difference. Fountain of Life and Death. Look at that huge effect of happiness. Uh, you know, we have this block that we've kind of reserved. But that's more of a commercial area. Like, this would have a really good effect right here. We'll move a couple people out. But it gives us a little bit of space in that area, right? So we'll do that. We'll decorate. We'll add some uh, some buildings. We'll fill in some of the holes and gaps. We'll start uh, folding in some of this new neighborhood. And we've got to start working on, on shipping at some point. Lots to do. Balancing the, uh, the workforce is definitely one of those things we've got to figure out, though. Things, uh, things not going so good over here in the industrial sector. I don't know why that is. Is it because we're, because we're offering too much education now, and people are going that way anyways? I, I thought it, there was kind of a, an auto balance to that, that, uh, that allowed. I, I mentioned this in one of the last episodes. Like, it would be so nice if they didn't. Like, I, I don't mind if there's, you know, repeats of buildings all over the place, but three in a row. We don't, we don't need three cinemas right here, or is it one giant cineplex? They're probably, I mean, come on, they're all showing the same movie, right? What is showing? I don't, can I even read that? That is, that is tough to make out. Chirpzilla? Chirpzilla something, let's see, can we get it from the other side? Is it the, is it the sun? I don't know, maybe that maybe that comes through on YouTube that does not come through on my TV. Colossal something, colossal cranium. I I can't even make those out. All right, never mind. <laughs> never. Anyways, three cinemas. They're all playing the same things. So we've got we've got work to do, right? We've got problems, and we'll we'll diagnose those a bit in the uh, the next episode. I think I think that's a good way to go. What what's up with the noise complaints over here, huh? Too much traffic? Yeah, we got it. Oh, that's the other thing, right? So we didn't connect this to the metro at all yet. Um, this is a really isolated pocket of town right now. We've got to start working over here. Bring this highway up through here. We'll buy this tile next uh, because, right? I think it makes sense. We'll just we're gonna commit to it because now I can bring the highway up here. We can sort of. We can plant some trees right there and and not use that section of the map. I think right we wanna we wanna not use that, but we might use this this river river area. Maybe do a little industrial area and a, a shipping yard. I don't know. I don't think shipping connects here, but we could do some fishing boats to kind of make it look like it does, and uh, and have the actual uh, shipping harbor over here. I think that's where the routes are. But so much to do, so little time. I'll try and keep these a little bit more manageable. Last episode was crazy, but I got carried away and uh, didn't know how to edit it down. So hopefully today will be a little bit more succinct. I'm going to try and keep them under 30 minutes for the most part. Let me know what you want to see in the comments down below. If you enjoyed the video, likes, comments, and shares all help the channel a lot and are greatly appreciated. If you're new here, subscribe for more, considering the bell to get notifications for updates in this and other series. Follow me on Twitter and join the Discord if you want to get involved in the discussion. 
you want to support the channel, there's links to that and all those other things in the description down below. But until the next one, I forgot to check on that water. Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Holy cow, pause. Uh, <laughs> you, you were running down in the comments to say, hey, you forgot the water. And technically I did, but I remember just in time. Okay, we're turning that off. Ay. Ay, 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 ay. All right, well. I mean. <laughs> just when you thought I avoided one disaster. Um, I mean, the house fires aren't that bad. It's just, it's a constant nuisance. And, you know, sometimes the trees catch. And at least we've got the helicopter service now. Um, so, uh, I was pretty close to, uh, to getting out of here. So let's just uh, skip to it. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the town of Swamp Scott. Better than it sounds. Until the next one, this is Moving Mouse, signing off.